Hey everybody, this is 10 Minutes with God. Today is Trinity Sunday. But at the same time, we also know this weekend is Memorial Weekend. When we talk about Trinity Sunday, to us it's a mystery. And a mystery, what is a mystery? So a mystery is something that, that happens, human understanding cannot comprehend. Human cannot explain what happened. They just see it. They can tell a story about it. But if you were to ask them, what does it mean? No one knows. So it's that mystery. So when we talk about the Trinity Sunday, where we know about our one God in three persons. So three in one, this is something if we were in a math class, we cannot understand. Our God is three in one. But it's a mystery to us, but we know for our God is real, and also we need to take it as if, as it is real. God the Father saw the problem that we had in this world, our sin, how we hate our brothers and sisters. And then our sin, the result of our sin is for us to die but God said no I don't want you to die I want to send you my only son and he will be able to fulfill everything that you could not fulfill this is where the mystery starts so God the father decided to send God the son and then God the son died for us and he rose again and then he went back to the father and then god the son sent us god the holy spirit to hold us safe in this world because we're still living in this world and he left us a mission what is the mission the mission is to go make disciples into all the world baptizing them in the name of the father and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Again, the Trinity. One God in three persons. But a mystery, when you cannot understand or we cannot explain it, there is something that's very important in our life as Christians. And this is faith. Faith, if you go into the book of Hebrews, chapter 11, verses 1, he said, faith, faith is the assurance of things hoped for, the conviction of things not seen. But what does that mean? It means what you believe, you believe in the Trinity, you believe in God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit, because God again gives you faith. And Verse 3 in that same chapter said, By faith we understand that the universe was created by the word of God. And also by faith we know that um, everything that we've seen was created out of nothing. So to believe in something like that is very remarkable. But the faith that God gives to us, gives us the opportunity to understand and to believe in something that the world cannot explain. We cannot explain. The scientists cannot explain. But Christian, we have the faith of God so that we understand the world, the tree, the first of all, God, the Father, God, the Son, God, the Holy Spirit, and their role into what is here today. But we have uh, something tangible again. We are living in the United States and we know there are a lot of sacrifices. Many sacrifices have been made for us to be here, to live free, to go out and without fear. And that's why this weekend is about Memorial Weekend. It's when men and women, they gave their lives so that we may be free today. So they gave their life, they fought, and they gave us today so that we can be free. They gave us a country. But our God did something that's bigger than what they even did. God, Jesus Christ, 
came into this world, he died for us. He not only gave us a country, he not only gave us this world, but he also gave us eternal life. Eternal life, that means one day we will live with him forever and ever. This is wonderful news. A mystery we cannot understand, a mystery we cannot explain, but by faith we understand that it is true. By faith we understand that God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit together give us peace, together give us eternal life, together give us the life that we live in today. Again, this is Trinity Sunday. This is Memorial Sunday. We not only celebrate the fact that we have a country, we are free, but we also celebrate the fact that our God, three in one, makes something that no one can explain. And today we can live not only free in this world, but also we know one day we will be free in heaven with the triune God, God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. So these 10 minutes with God are very important because this is one thing, one time you can find a direct connection with explaining or with talking about a topic in the Bible, something that you would have to go to school for, something that you would have to ask your pastor about. But 10 minutes with God give you an opportunity to listen and reflect on various topics. I hope that you enjoy these 10 minutes with God that we're sending to you through our website. And also I hope that you share these 10 minutes with God because it's 10 minutes. So somebody cannot say, oh, I'm not gonna wait an hour to listen to all these things, but it's only 10 minutes. So we hope that you enjoy them. And we hope that you go to our website, it's an S-T-P-A-U-L-L-U-T-H-E-R-N-L-A.org. So you can go, not only you will see our service every Sunday, but also you'll see all these 10 minutes with God. And also, you can help us, help us with that ministry to donate, because there is a way you can donate to help the church grow and to help us send these messages around the world. This is Vicar Jean Enoch Beres. I was here to spend 10 minutes with you, which we call 10 Minutes with God. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you share it to your friends. And please ask him to like our 10 Minutes with God. Thank you.